I want to be a music teacher. At Community Music, I want to be a music teacher or I want to teach music are requests that we hear a lot. Although it's not unrealistic to want to become a music teacher, being prepared and knowing exactly where you want to teach is key. So we're here to ask you some questions that you may not have thought about, hopefully helping you to a clearer vision, enabling you to embark on your journey towards becoming a music teacher. Firstly, this may be the most obvious question, but it will probably be the hardest one to answer. Why do you want to be a music teacher? For the money is not a legitimate answer. If that was your first thought, then teaching probably isn't for you. Sorry. Think about the first time you said to yourself, I want to be a music teacher. Once you've established why, the following questions will hone in on the specifics of being a music teacher. Are you qualified? Different levels of teaching require different levels of qualification. Check out our video, How Long Does It Take to Become a Music Teacher, which gives you a breakdown of what qualifications you need for different types of teaching and how long it takes to acquire them. What level do you want to teach at? In statutory education, there are clear, delineated levels and you should think about which key stage you would most like to work with. In further education settings, students can choose to specialise and learn a deeper, more specific level. This leads on nicely to the next question. Do you know enough about a certain subject to be able to teach it at a higher level? The word enough in this sense means that you have sufficient experiences within that topic, as well as the knowledge and being able to reference real life situations to back up what you're teaching. At what intensity do you want to teach? Do you want to teach in terms and semesters, like at schools, colleges and universities, over a year or two? Or would you prefer teaching an intensive weekend course? Or would you rather teach a student on a particular instrument for one evening a week? How many students would you like in your class? You may prefer teaching one-to-one, -one, or you may thrive in the environment of teaching to a larger number of people on a subject you're passionate about. Some people are great teachers in small classes, but get nervous and shy in front of larger groups. It depends on how you feel you teach best. What age range, if any, do you want to teach to? For teaching in schools, you'll be teaching to age ranges and not by ability, and in many cases, people who may not be immediately passionate about the subject. For certain age ranges, you'll also need an enhanced DBS check. Saying, I want to be a music teacher, comes with all these other questions and more. You may feel that you're ready to teach, so now is the time to think about all the rest that comes with it. Saying I want to be a music teacher is a great start to becoming one, but as you're probably well aware after this video, there is a lot more to think about. You need to be mentally prepared for a career in teaching, so it's best to get a head start now. If you manage to answer these questions with ease, then you're probably ready to start your new career path. So get yourself qualified. If you have any more questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments below and we'll do our best to answer them for you. Subscribe to our channel and watch our other music teaching videos for some great tips, information and some insights into the world of music teaching.